Hello everyone and welcome to today's short episode. Today I'm going to be sharing with you what I do with musky vintage books. As a lot of you have probably realized, as collectors, resellers, flippers, etc, etc, most antique and vintage books are going to have a bit of a stench. Whether it's a muskiness like this one, or even a smell of a cigarette. Uh, going back not too long ago, cigarette smoking, pipe tobacco, cigars was actually pretty common. Most households probably had at least one person that did smoke, so it's pretty common for items to have that smell. So what I do with my items is I take them, I take one of these Arm & Hammer fridge and freezer packs, make sure it's pretty fresh. I only use these about a month and then I toss them. These are great because it keeps the bacon soda from actually getting all over your item. You can take a large gallon size Ziploc bag, a poly nailer like I have here, or even a tote. But if you have a tote, I recommend using multiple of these because one might not be enough with the more air that's going to be contained in there. So I'm just going to take it, put it in my poly bag, and put my baking soda in there as well. And I'm going to seal it up as tightly as possible with the self-adhesive side on there. And last but not least, you can also date this so you'll know how many days it's been sitting. I recommend letting most things soak, well, not soak, but at least be in the bag. About two days, maybe more so. This item is pretty stinky, so I'm going to leave this in here for about a week, and hopefully they'll take care of the issue. Alright everybody, thank you for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe.